Okay, this is John Cool. Got to knock out a quick video on my phone before I forget to do it. I made a bucket mute today for one of my students. I've made mutes before from aluminum bottles and canning funnels. Beautiful sounding adjustable cup mute. Um, I've made mute racks. I've made shakers and gyros out, out of tools at hand, cheap. And I made this bucket mute, and it sounds incredible, and I've got less than four bucks into it. Here's a bucket that I got at Michael's. Michael's is a hobby shop. I think it's a national chain, certainly all over in eastern Nebraska. Um, I may cut the bale off, but it gives it kind of a nice rattle. I took some spring-loaded clothespins apart, and JB welded them and the interior, all at the same distance, right up to that first line for my horn. And th that's it. I think under two, under two bucks for the bucket and whatever, three clo two clothespins that, that I had to tear apart and a little bit of JB Weld. No stuffing in here right now, uh, but listen to this. I'm going to snap it on. I'll watch, see if I can do this with one hand. It fits on the bell really well. And if not, I would sand it down here. Shoot. Can't do it one-handed very well. All right. there's It's on the horn anyway, and you can see that. Fits because I, I spaced my uh, clothespins. So it's got a nice distance from the thing. And now listen to this sound. I'm going to play it left-handed. Probably make some mistakes because I'm holding the phone in the other hand. So you get the idea. That's it. Two minutes, 32 seconds. Thanks.